friends, if you're a part of the family, welcome back. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Um, so for today's video, I'm going to review um, probably a product that's been out for a while, um, but I just now came across it. And it is the Wet n Wild uh, Micro Brow Pencil. Uh, the Ultimate Brow Micro Brow Pencil. I just picked it up yesterday at Target. I have been uh, in the hunt for a an affordable um, drugstore eyebrow pencil. Um, and I came across this one, it reminded me a lot of the um, Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Micro um, Brow Wiz uh, that everybody in the beauty world raves about and loves. Uh, and I've tried it before and I really do like it, but I was just going through it like so fast and that junk cost like $21. So I'm like, listen, there has to be something in the drugstore that is reasonably priced um, that is probably just as good because I have found a lot of dupes in the drugstore um, for high-end products. So I went on YouTube and um, I found a few um, that were like 10 bucks, seven bucks, which is still really good for a brow pencil. Um, but then I came across a review that they said that this one was actually a really good one. Um, and I'm like, huh, let me try it. So I went to Target yesterday and I picked it up and this junk <laughs> at Target is $2.99. So if this works for me, yo, like this might be like my brow product. Um, so Wet n Wild, I really love this uh, this brand. It's just amazing because the prices are, they're just not um, affordable, they're like cheap. Um, and the product itself, I think are really good, really, really good. So, so um, I have high hopes for this guy. So let's get to it. Um, this is in the color soft brown. I don't know if they have other colors. They only have two colors. They have a soft brown and they have a deep brown. The deep brown looks lighter than the soft brown. Anyways, they only have two shades. I'm really sorry. So hopefully this color color works. Soft brown is a color that I usually use on my brows anyway. So let's go to it. So this is what it looks like. This is the packaging. The size of the tip is 1.5 milliliter, millimeters. So it's definitely micro. Let's get to it. So my whole, I did my whole makeup today and I feel so weird because I don't have my brows. Brows really do um, take the look to the next level. This is kind of like mascara. Mascara does that too. But my look is obviously incomplete. I feel naked without my brows. So brows are a big deal, ladies out there who do not fill in your brows. And this is what it looks like. It has a spoolie in one end, which the Anastasia Brow Wiz has a spoolie super essential just saying and then here is the product that's how much product you get for three bucks so even if I go through this um, quickly I do fill my brows almost every day. Um, if I do, in fact, go through this rather quickly, it's fine. It's only three bucks. If it works, let me tell you, I'm going to the store and getting like five. <laughs> okay, so here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and comb. I have a mirror right here, guys, so I can't really use the camera screen to do my brows, so. Whoa, guys, this is really, really nice. Okay, so as you can see, 
I did, uh, I applied my brows just using kind of hair like strokes going all the way to the back. I'm not adding more to my brow, I'm literally just filling in what I already have. And that was super easy and super fast. The color payoff is really good as you can see. Look at my before and look at my after. It looks really natural. It's not too waxy, it's like waxy enough to control um, the hairs and like kind of help them stay in place. But the color is natural, right? I can see how this color would be very universal because the more I press down, obviously the darker it was, but if you do it very, very lightly, I can see how you can get more of like a light brown. But look at that. Wow. I'm impressed. All right, guys, so this is the final look. so right off the bat I actually really do like it um, for sure it says soft brown I think this one might be more of like a medium brown because the more um, I press down um, the darker it got um, so I think it could totally be it could be a soft brown if you go on it very very lightly very very softly then you can get a more of a soft brown um, but if you do press down um, harder um, on your brow then obviously it'll come out darker so um, I really like it it glided on smoothly um, I did it pretty fast so again the color payoff was there and it's not too waxy which is really good um, I tried the elf brow pencil and for me that was way too waxy like it looked like my brows had like no dimension they were just like flat um, but I'm really impressed this is my first impression on this one and I honestly really like it and for the price, bro, just one one key thing with your brows, they are never gonna look identical, okay? There's always one brow that is just easier for you to draw than the other one. For example, uh, this one's always easier for me to draw than this one. This one could come out perfect and then this one could come out like, okay? Um, so they're not meant to look identical, okay? They're not supposed to look like twins, they say. They're supposed to look like sisters. Like they're supposed to be similar but not identical. So anyways, if you're looking for an inexpensive um, brow micro, micro brow uh, pencil in the drugstore, I do recommend this guy over here, um, just based on my first impression. I would have to use it a lot more um, and see if actually it lasts the whole day because I've had brow pencils work and then like halfway through the day, like my brows are half gone, like what's going on, you know? So yeah, let me know if you guys have tried it and your thoughts, but so far, first impression, I really did like it. I would give it, say, an eight out of 10. And because of the price, dude, like I go to the store and get like four or five if you really like it because um, it's that economic. All right, guys, so that is about it for today's video. Let me know if you guys have tried it or if you guys are going to try it and let me know your thoughts, okay? All right, so stay tuned for a few messages from myself. Love you all and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Hello friends, thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos. It really does mean the world to me that you guys take the time to watch these videos. I really appreciate it, so thank you, thank you very much. I have a few messages to share with you guys. They are not long at all, I promise. So number one, I accept prayer requests. Um, me and my family have a list that we pray for every single day. So if you want us to add you and your prayer requests to our list, just go ahead and message me. Either leave a comment below or contact me through any of the social uh, media platforms that I have and we will go ahead and add you to our prayer list. Number two, if you are on Instagram, you should totally be following me. Why? Because I post a lot more content there than I do here, obviously, on YouTube. I post pictures of my kids, recipes, and such. So if you are on there, go ahead and follow me. And number three, if you are not already part of this family, go ahead and subscribe to this channel. You can hit the subscription button below and the notification bell so that you can get notified every time I upload a new video. We have so much fun here in this channel. I share with you guys recipes, I do Bible studies, I do makeup reviews, I do vlogs, I do videos with my kids. So if you wanna go ahead and join our family, like I said, go ahead and subscribe. All right guys, that's about it. Have an amazing day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.